Above the skies in southern Ontario, the northern lights dancing away. The waves of lights captivating many who don't usually get a chance to see them this far south. I ran out to the driveway and started taking pictures right away. I uh, called my wife out, you got to come see this. And just to know that everyone else who was paying attention was doing the same thing. There's kind of this uh, energy to the whole event that is really special and memorable. The Northern Lights or Aurora Borealis is caused by energized particles from the sun hitting the Earth's upper atmosphere. But our magnetic field redirecting the particles toward the North or South Pole. On Thursday night, they were visible in southern Ontario, likely caused by a burst of solar energy. The geomagnetic storm was unexpectedly stronger than anticipated, leading to a visual display of different hues of color dancing amongst the sky. Trevor Jones, an astrophotographer, captured images of the phenomenon from the comfort of his home. Everyone takes notice when you see ribbons of green and pink in the night sky. So uh, the last time I saw it this good was in 2011. So it's been a long time since I've seen the Northern Lights this well from Southern Ontario. While it felt like a rarity to Jones, there is a chance the Northern Lights could be visible again Friday night. Get away from the city light pollution if you can. Let your eyes get dark adapted for 25 to 30 minutes. That's your best chance at actually seeing the Northern Lights. And even if you miss it tonight, the Northern Lights could be visible around Southern Ontario more often. So we're moving into a period of, of more solar activity. So there's going to be more opportunities, may, maybe tonight, but if not tonight, uh, you know, in the, in the next couple of years, it's going to be more and more common. There's going to be more opportunities to see them. MR Khan, Global News.